Hey, welcome back to another edition of AVA Face Brew Review. My name is Alex. I'll be walking you guys and gals through this review for the next few minutes few minutes and moments here today. Uh, we've got a really interesting beer actually that I've never had before from Carton Brewing out of uh, Atlantic Highlands, New Jersey, but it's actually canned by Two Roads Brewing uh, out of Stratford, Connecticut. So kind of an interesting uh, ideology there. I've never really seen that. I know that it happens back on the East Coast, not so much more on the West Coast. It will happen with some macro uh, breweries like Red Hook up here in the Northwest and uh, Rainier Brewing Company as well. So, uh, but it's cool to see with the craft uh, brewing company. I mean, I really can't think of anything off the top of my head here in Washington State or even in Oregon for that matter. Uh, but regardless, we're getting into the unjunk stout, um, getting into the specs of the beer. It clocks in at 8.5% alcohol by volume. We've got 60 IBUs on the can here today. Shout out to Dave from New, Jer New Jersey, excuse me for sending this. Uh, pretty fresh for the most part uh, for a stout. 12, 15, 2017. Today's time of recording is the 5th of February day after the Super Bowl. So, uh, really, really excited to be here, like I said, with you guys and gals. Sorry I haven't been doing that many reviews lately. I've been pretty busy with some other things uh, going on in my life, but definitely look forward to doing some reviews uh, here in the next uh, few days and weeks to come. So, getting into the accolades of the beer real quick from Beer Advocate, it looks like 4.12 out of 5, putting in that uh, exceptional, outstanding category. And then from the folks on Untap, 3.99 out of 5. Uh, out of five uh, caps there, so some good stuff going on. Uh, other than that, really don't have much more to talk about uh, with the beer. You can read the uh, commercial description on the side there. I don't really want to waste your time with that, but basically they're just not adding any adjuncts to this stout. No coffee, no vanilla, uh, no doesn't look like there's any barrel on this one, but it gives you uh, tasting notes of coffee, chocolate, vanilla, smoke, and dark fruits, and molasses, and a myriad of other flavors. So without further ado, let's crack the cap on the Unjunk Stout from Carton Brewing Company out of Atlantic Highlands, New Jersey. Pretty aggressive pour there. You can see this head. I'm trying to level it out, but pretty, pretty dense. Beautiful head. I mean, look at that. Just a chocolatey mocha brown head and complexion there. Very, very tight, tightly compact bubbles at the bottom here, and then getting a little more um, aerated toward the top, but really, really nice, beautiful head. Uh, that is a very, very opaque beer. There is no light getting through that. That is a jet black uh, beer. Wow, no, no real carbonation so much to speak of in terms of it kind of migrating from the bottom of the glass to the top. But yeah, really nice. We swirl it around. We get some nice glass lacing just kind of clinging to the side of the glass. A little sticky. Really nice stuff. Beautiful, beautiful mocha brown head there. So let's get a smell and aroma in this bad boy, see what's going on. Wow, big dark chocolate, cocoa, coffee. That's really what comes to mind first up. I do get some of that molasses they were talking about, and then the dark fruits like raisins, plums, figs. A little brown sugar maybe, like toasted dark bread or something, bready sweetness there. A little smoke. Really, it is a myriad of flavors. My gosh, it's a nice complexity of this beer. Some earthy, hoppy notes, ever so faint. A little vanilla char in there. I really don't drink much like regular stouts. I mean, I really like barrel-aged stouts for that matter. I love what the barrel characteristic does to the stout. That oakiness brings out vanilla characteristics and it rounds out that roastiness of the stout. Um, I love a nice dry Irish stout. Uh, I really, really do, especially on nitro draft. Um, but really, you know, anything in between, I just, I don't really drink it. There's a lot of good stuff out there, but... Um, I am excited for this one. So without further ado, let's get into the uh, Unjunked Stout by Carton Brewing Company. Cheers, Prost. That's nice. Wow. Yeah. Nice big dark chocolate right up front. Just... Slap of the tongue there, followed by that cocoa note, almost like a baker's chocolate kind of 
cocoa powder. And then I get the coffee, kind of like um, black coffee, not cold brew, so to speak, but just like a cold black coffee. Then you kind of get into the molasses, really kind of comes out as well. I get some of the dried fruits initially after that, that raisin, fig, date type of, of fruitiness that you'll see in a lot of these stouts or winter ales. It's just really nice roasted malt. There is a little bit of smoke in there as well. Some char from that roast. Kind of the back end you finishes like toasty and it lingers with a nice kind of vanilla vanilla characteristic. It's not so artificial vanilla but you can tell that it's there. Um, I wouldn't say that it's totally vanilla though. There is some of the fruitiness and the char. You get more of the char and the smoke kind of all intertwined. It's just incredibly complex. There's a lot going on in terms of the flavor profile from this beer and what they've accomplished. And then there is a little bit of like an earthy kind of pepperiness in terms of the hop quality to it as well. It's really nice. No astringency at all. It's a nice light dryness, nice bitterness that um, that hangs out. It's a beautiful sweet balance. No alcohol at all for 8.5%. Holy hell, you really, really knock this back. That's what I'm doing here. This is very nice. Very nice and drinkable. I'm, very, I'm really enjoying it. Mouthfeel is probably my favorite part of this beer. I'll be really candid with you. Beautiful, medium, smooth to full body that just coats the palate with this resinous, sticky, chalky um, sweetness, but it's not overly sweet. It's not astringent in any way. It's really easy to, to drink, yet it's rich and malty all at the same time. Nice mild carbonation adding to um, the, the drinkability of this beer. So with all that said and considered from Carton Brewing, um, Let's go 90. I think it's an A beer, A minus beer. It's really solid. This is a good one. So thank you, Dave. Shout out to you. Really appreciate your uh, your willingness to send this out. Your beers are coming soon. I've just been collecting them. But uh, with, with all you with all you guys out there, let me know what you what you thought. Um, you know, 90 from me, but that's not matters. It matters what you guys and gals think. So le leave it all below in the comments section. Did you love? Did you hate it? What did you think about the Carton Brewing Unjunk Stout? Until next time, guys, I really appreciate each and every one of you. I really do. I say it every time. So thank you so much again. We'll see you all again on Bayface Brew Review.